Hey YouTube, it's me, it's iPhoneCaptain.com, and we're going to try to jailbreak the iPhone 6. Luca has released a new beta. I think this is beta 3, and he's added several devices in the mix. I think he's pretty much got everything going now except the 7 and 7 Plus, and I think the 7 is even jailbreakable on 10.1.1. So, we're doing the iPhone 6 on 10.2. So, you can follow along if you want to do that. You're going to need a couple things. You're going to need City Impactor and the Jailbreak, of course. And those links are in the description below. Just click down there. They're directly from his site and 100% legitimate and safe. And just so, before we get started, guys, you do have to enter your uh, Apple password and ID. And this needs to be a working Apple password and ID. And you are... Uh, more than welcome to create a new one if you are in any way uncomfortable about entering your your uh, Apple ID in. But we have been assured that this only goes to Cydia, which we know Sark is in charge of. And he has thousands upon thousands of uh, credit card numbers, and we've never had any issues with that at all. I've been using this service for a long time, never had any problems there. So what I'm trying to get across to you is this is 100% safe. Don't worry about it, but if you want to create a new Apple ID, you will need to do that before you can jailbreak your device. And the first thing you're going to have to do, of course, is, is to open Cydia Impactor. And if you haven't downloaded it, downloaded it yet, you can go to CydiaImpactor.com. Download it for Windows or Mac, and you can see I'm on Mac. And once you have it installed, you just simply, uh, once it downloads, I should say, you, dra you drag this over into your folders and let it go and if you want to you can click replace you know I've already got it in there so you're it won't do that for you but anyway now we're going to open it up CD Impactor and you can see that it did lo it's loaded up on the screen here right here we'll start it we'll start fresh okay so now we're going to start CD Impactor and as you all know we tried to do this earlier last week in the week last week and uh, it, it did everything but it just didn't put city on there for us so today we're going to try to see what happens and maybe things will go a little bit differently what you have to do here you see I've got the alpha 3 right here um, you need to drag this over top of city impactor release it now here's where you have to enter in your Apple ID and password and then once you do that you click OK and then that's going to actually start the jailbreak process now i'm sort of going to skip over some of that because it does have some private information in it and it's not really necessary for the video anyway and we're going to come on here and i'm going to show you something and i already have city on there because of course i try i've been trying to jailbreak this device for several several days now and what i'm going to show you now is we have a yalu 1002 or 102 icon and that's what city impactor did it loaded this on your device now what this does is it lets you sign this yourself through apple uh, for seven days so if you run this longer than seven days you probably will have to put this back on there again in the event you need to re jailbreak now what do i mean by re jailbreak if your device loses power such as battery going down or you turn it off you will have to repatch the kernel now that's what the, that's what the uh, the technical terminology is all it boils down to is it gets your jailbreak working again and it just all it is it just takes the process of running this application again open it up when you open it up you just have a little you have a little screen there and it's got go on the inside just tap go and it will re jailbreak your device you do not need the computer to do that part uh, so that's very simple and easy to do now uh, you may need to have to come back in here if you have to put the the uh, application back on as I was referring to earlier after the seven day period you'll have to have a computer so you may need to borrow a friend's computer to use City Impactor to install the Yalu jailbreak icon back on your screen so you can jailbreak but if you keep your device running and there's no reason that you should turn it off uh, it won't hurt it one bit I can assure you that that's what these uh, devices are made for 
uh, it will not affect it in any way or your battery whatsoever. Leave it on. Don't, that way you won't have to worry about all of what I'm telling you about. You'll have to put uh, Yalu back on there with City Impactor and Regio Breaker Device. Now, what I have done, I've already run uh, the Yalu jailbreak. And it has already jailbroken my device. So, when you open up the Yalu, it will actually have the word go right here. And you just tap go. And all it's going to do is it's going to run and restart your device. And what it's doing is it's actually jailbreaking your device. And it's putting the city icon on there. Now, if you want to see if your device was actually jailbroken, then all you have to do is open the Yalu application up. If you still see the word go, it did not work. Try it again. Okay? Run it two or three times if you have to. Maybe you need to turn the device off and turn it back on. Okay? Then you can try it. You know, that's not going to affect the Yalu. You won't lose the Yalu icon by turning your device off. You lose the jailbreak by turning it off. Cydia will quit working. So once you have that running, then you're going to have a Cydia icon on your device right here. And then you just tap on it and it should load up. Now, I had a lot of trouble with what you just seen occurring right there. Mine just continuously keeps crashing and crashing and crashing. So what I recommend you do if that does occur is just run your jailbreak a few more times and see if you can't get things running properly. Now, one other thing I did skip over telling you is after you install the Yalu uh, icon on your screen, you're going to have to come in here and give trust to this profile before it will even work. So you come in here and you give this developer, you, you will have to tap trust right there in the center of the screen. So once you have done that, then you can come back in here and try to keep opening up City. And as you can see now, this time, it's going to load up. So it may just take a couple tries, guys. And you can see right down here at the bottom. And I'll try to remember to zoom this in for you guys. And I'm going to unplug this. Right down at the bottom. And don't worry about that. That's just got something to do with your actual load. Uh, that, that's normal for Cydia. But anyway, I'm going to try to zoom this if I can. To show you right down here at the bottom, it says iPhone 7.2. And that's the identifier for this. Running 10.2, Cydia 1127. So that just goes to show you the proof that we do have this jailbreak running. Cydia is up on this device. And look at the, look at the Desco has killed it once again guys if you aren't a subscriber please hit that subscribe button share this video with all your friends i have some awesome guides and tutorials on how to jailbreak on iphonecaptain.com if you need some written step-by-step -step instructions we got it over there if we don't have it let me know what you want in the comments i will get it posted so you can get it whatever it is you need i'm here to help you any way i can just leave a comment and we'll get it to you and as once again, as I already said, if you aren't a subscriber, hit that subscribe button, share this video, and keep coming back.